Stayed in the hostel last night. Hostels in Iceland are a little bit different to what we're used to. Oh yeah, we're meth dealers now. Yeah, you missed it. My teeth came in and then fell out again. They're pretty sweet. Nice little double bedroom here. Little village of the damned window over there. Iceland. Good hostels. Alfred Hitchcock watching over us as you sleep. Is that Alfred Hitchcock? No. <laughs> we still need to share a bathroom though. Oh, this view is nice. They have salmon. They have waffles as well. I love this place. So the story behind this place is that it used to be a school back in the day. And what they did is they, they took it and converted it into like a boutique hostel. It's still not cheap like hostels are normally, but it's a hostel and it's an Icelandic version of the hospital. And to be honest, what is cheap in Iceland? He said hospital. Did I say hospital? <laughs> I'm in hostel. Okay, so here's my thoughts on Iceland so far. No, 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 do, no. Do, do, be cool. Like, come on. I'm sorry, please go ahead. As I said, this is my second time I've come and it's still the same. It's such a land of contrast. You would be driving in the middle of nowhere and you would see only one car in like a 20 minute space of time and, and then you'd come, come across a town, a really small little town. And, You'd come into the town and it would just be completely first world. Like everything is done just right. I just love the contrast of just nothing and almost kind of desolation. In, out in the, the middle of nowhere and then you come across civilization and it's so civilized. I do like Iceland a lot, I must admit. <laughs> anything okay we're here at Silfra. Silfra is part of a, a network of I'd say big crevices that is filled up with Arctic water the water is around one degree Celsius two degrees Celsius literally just above freezing and we're going snorkeling here, so it should be a lot of fun, I think. But they give you a dry suit, they, they give you all the type of equipment, and the water is crystal clear, crystal clear. So it's beautiful, I've done this before, but right now we're running horribly late. Is what a dry suit looks like. It makes sure you don't get wet, and it's lovely and warm. I might just keep it for the rest of Iceland. From here on out, off we go. I'm gonna change to the GoPro, and hopefully, oh, I can't even move my hands. Hopefully the battery's gonna last for the hour that we're going to be in this water.
my hair, my hair is frozen as well. Look, it's literally frozen. It's like it's like I've got hard gel in there. Yours? It's frozen. Yeah, there's icicles in your hair. <laughs> oh well, that was a lot of fun. I'm glad I could share it with my wife. Mm -hmm. yeah. That was fun. Girls are gross. I um, <laughs> put that in your vlog. <laughs> yeah. So anyway, so that what's beautiful about that is that the two tectonic plates are literally separated by this rift valley, and it goes into this beautiful water. It's been filtered for like. How long did he say? Like 30 years? The glacier years. melts and water goes through the volcanic rock for 30 years and gets spat out where we started off on that railing that you saw. Now we're going into Reykjavik to uh, the Blue Lagoon and uh, that's where we're spending the night. Jess is dying to see one of these Icelandic horses. Oh, it's coming over, Jess. We've seen many, but I wanted to pick one. He's got like a Justin Bieber thing going on there. I'm already looking at you. <laughs> But the Blue Lagoon is not famous for that hotel room. What it's famous for is this. This is nice. And what's the most awesome part is that we're here just after the Christmas holidays, so there's like no one here. like the nicest people you've ever met and you go on holiday you just get on well with people well that's not really the case here yeah like, he like, hates being on camera really so much awkward on camera. So, this is, this was gonna happen. so how do you yeah. feel like if i take this camera ben and i just put you right there extremely awkward, <laughs> is it awkward? 